All right, folks, you asked for it. It's Weapon Hack the System Warrior. The goal of the deck is to use the Hack the System quest, draw a bunch of weapons, buff them up with things like Obsidian Smith, Lady Ashvane, and Hobart Grapple Hammer, so that we can put them into our hand, then play Furnace Fire Colossus, followed by Charge to bash our opponent in the face for a whole lot of damage. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Ruffle. Watch this! All right, Warlock gets low is the good news, so maybe that gives me a chance. The bad news is that the chaos. they could have taunts. I'm going to keep the Hobart and probably the Forged in Flame. Why are my cards so low? Am I crazy? Feels like they're hiding. Which is worse, this warrior deck or Noggenfogger Warrior? Uh, probably Noggenfogger Warrior still, just because, like, that, so much of that was outside of my control. Oh, I lose this game too. Prepare the Mecha Chicken? Cards are definitely lower. Thank you. I'm not crazy, though. We're all good help, I suppose. You fully copied the list, or did you make some adjustments? I made some adjustments. What is your best matchup with this deck? Non-existent. The deck is terrible. a good draw at least. Brawl helps me a little bit. Honestly, I think I would kind of just need a deadly arsenal to survive a turn. But I probably do have to brawl this. Well, okay. That's something. Maybe Immolator Warlock? No, I absolutely couldn't be Immolator Warlock with this deck. Like, this is one of like the very few decks in the world where Immolate actually wrecks it because I have to hold a, like by the design I hold a lot of cards. Warlock, Warlock, is that a thing? Uh, it, I mean, it's an archetype that was pushed at the very beginning of the expansion. Wait, that's main deck? Please be something large. Nice. Next turn I can go here and here. Are there any control decks you win against? There aren't any control decks in Wild that don't have like a game ending combo that will be faster than mine. Like, uh, Cthune Druid is, like, a control deck, but, like, a Cthune Druid can, um, play all four pieces of Cthune, then draw the Cthune and play it multiple times before I assemble the combo. Alright. If I can make it... Sure. Two more turn. Like, I've got a lot of damage. This is 14, 19. It's fine. This is a lot of damage. I just need the furnace base. Furnace, furnace fire? How much damage is this going to be on board, though? 16. I will not be denied. Didn't draw it. Ooh. 
This is 14. Oh my god. Are we gonna get there? Just don't die this turn. Yeah, I think we're good. Quest is doing some serious work. Yeah, the quest never made sense in, the, <laughs> in this deck. But... Don't tell that to the YouTube comments. Oh my god, I can't believe we did it. Whew! Uh, this hand is just atrocious. That makes it a little bit better because at least I can play the cutting class. Delightful. Seems like that order could have been reversed. Or just, like, held until next turn. Maybe they're looking for Oaken Summons, but even then, like... Okay, yeah, no Oaken Summons yet. It's a good hand. It recovered nicely from the opponent. I was going to say not doing anything, but then they started doing things. Uh, this doesn't buff the weapon in play anyway. Well met. DJ, thank you for the prime. I will not be denied. Okay, so it's dragon. It's a blast from the past. charge once again but I do have a lot of uh, ways to draw weapons that's bad for me but I do have brawls that aren't going to do anything Missed both of the weapons I was looking for in the blacksmithing hammers. It's possible we've got an opening here, but I need to, like, this is a major concern. Never mind, we don't have an opening here. Well, that gave me a bit of an opening. This gives me some time. Please don't let anything ridiculous happen here. Good. 
How big are the weapons? They're at eight. Are they at eight? One's at eight, one's at seven, maybe? Fifteen. Hmm. Let's just maybe draw them first. Eight. Oh, I thought I... Oh, I thought that was my last one. Okay. It's fine. So this is 13, 16, 22, 24 damage. Alright, just need to dodge some weirdness again. Good. Should be lethal, right? I will not be denied. Did I just play the uh, Corsair Cache off the top, then furnace fire into uh, charge? No taunt here. Pretty sure it's enough. This must be the I way. can't play Earthen Scales, so I don't even think that would save them. I do have another Blacksmithing Hammer. Goes up to 8, 16. Plus another 8, 24. Yeah, that's enough. Oh my god, we did it! Ooh. Full deck, but I'm missing most of the cards. That's that's a good thing. Keep it that way, I promise. Just just keep it that way. Uh, I feel like this card has been underperforming. It's possible it should be more card draw or another weapon. Or Finley. I think Finley would be very bad. Well, maybe. I don't know. Uh, I think this is uh, Hand Mage. Go here, see if we get a better chance at the blackness smithing hammer. We got both of them, okay. Job done. What weapon in that case though? Gorehal? Uh, I don't think this deck wants Gorehal. I think it would maybe be the um the four mana three three that draws a weapon. The Outrider's Axe, is it? Or that draws a card, then you're getting card draw and uh, a weapon all in one. Uh that's devastatingly bad for me. I did not want to see a secret get played. Job's done. What this deck really needs is Jesus? No, that's my YouTube comment section. That's what that you're thinking of, not this deck. Wait, it's Mech Mage, but like not Reno Mech Mage? That would be pretty bad. Can this deck not beat Ice Block? Probably not, but like they still have to remove the big Colossal, uh, like the Colossus that we get. Explosive Sheep is a mech, yeah, but not one that you run in Mech Mage. I understand that Explosive Sheep is a mech, but an aggro deck doesn't want to clear its own board most of the time. Oh, thank God! Wait. Is that good? I mean, it's good in the sense that it's not ice block, so... In, in a way, it's good. Well... Maybe that one will be ice block. Uh, do I have an answer to that, other than just playing the blacksmithing hammer? Let's see if I can get a less valuable weapon. Okay, well... Or 
if we just ignore I that and go face? Be denied. And then keep going face until the opponent is out of face. Uh, I just don't want to take the risk that that's like a um, grid fair game or something. The hammer alone has enough damage to kill. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm setting up is like the more damage I can get off of this hammer. Uh, I was probably going to brawl this turn anyway, so. Come on. Like, that was unironically the worst outcome. That completely decimated my win condition here. Having to send 14 into that. I could have sworn it went back together. Okay, that time it was the best outcome for me. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. Do I even have enough? 10, 14, 20, 22, I have enough. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. I'm not dead, I'm not dead. Hold? Is this two in a row? Move, please. Oh, it's 24. I miscounted. Come. Embrace the chaos. Hey, welcome, Time Ghost. I think I have to keep a bear off into Rogue. But it doesn't matter because I just get, like, stomped by pirates regardless of what I do. Like, I think I would actually have a better chance against this deck. Me some time, I suppose. Glory. I'm here for the glory. Don't you want to run very few pirates on the stack? I will not be denied. I might need to go from the depths into the sunken trident just so that I can clear their pirates prior to the uh, quest coming down. Love the feel of wind yeah. I'm going to go ahead and kill that so that they can't bounce it. Whoops. Thank you. Got two clears lined up already. Wait for me. The two mana shadow step. Yeah. Uh, this is fine though. Uh, 
Uh, actually, in a pretty good spot here. Because once again, I can go Barov into a uh, swing to clear. What? Brawl is also good. This after or yeah after. Does I barrel even work on quest? Yeah. Uh because it overrides it. Like it's the more most recent thing takes priority. So I, I think I want to go bear of. It's quiet. I'm sorry, what? Quiet. What is going on in this game? The next turn is bear of swing plus a Corsair cash. Then I play brawl and the bulwark, which has a fair number of weapon charges. This is a build unlike any other I've seen. We are actually getting close. Just need the Furnace Fire. Which is good that I've been holding onto this coin. Do try to keep okay, got both of those back. Uh, that's 14. That's enough damage just with like one of those. Oh no, well, one and a half, I guess. But all I'm short is a furnace fire. I have the mana. I hope you like my invention. Have the damage. Oh, come on, not like this. Follow my lead. Tactical error. This is the end of all things. Oh no. No, please not again. Come. Not the rogues. Embrace the chaos. Okay. Got doubled two drop. We've got Barov to clear boards. There are just a lot of rogue decks that uh don't really give me much of a chance. Maybe SI7 Rogue, uh, they would still beat me. Have you even finished the quest once? Uh, no, because you never swing with the weapons. You, or you rarely swing with the weapons. You want to discard the weapons, not play them most of the time. All it takes is a lot of lava. Like, the benefit is that this buffs, but then this buffs all of my weapons, so I think I would rather go with the Hobart. Plus the Hobart gets buffed anyway, so... Mill Rogue. There's some Hopium there. I just am never playing this card. I don't want them to be able to bounce that is the uh, thought process there. They didn't need to. I want you and you and you. Sure. 
I will not be denied. Play around vanish. Because I'd rather have the Hobart back. I mean, this is one where we can just swing a bunch. I've got the combo. I just need to make sure that, like, I probably don't even trade these, right? How many weapons do I have? I have two. Shearing slash. Do try to keep yourselves alive. Just wait it out until turn nine, hopefully. Kind of ambitious. They might just be able to kill me before then, but. Need to break that with a weapon. I will not take more. Fine. Go here and here to get the other trident. And just need to dodge the other cloak of shadows. Do I even play this? It just gets me closer to fatigue and I don't need the damage. Follow my lead. Try and avoid dying. Maybe could have accelerated this game if I played the backsmithing hammer earlier. But we're through three out of five of the cards that I'm concerned about dying to. Please no prep. No, 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 no. No cloak, no cloak, no cloak. Uh, is that, that's the second prep. We're safe, we're safe, we get there. Ooh. Oh my god, is this three in a row now? Right, right. I skipped the pirate rogue. That doesn't count, though. Oh my god, I'm free. Oh my god. I can move on with my life. Thank you to legendary patrons Brian Wynn, Fizzle Jizzix, Gian Rusi, HS Battlefly, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Nate Drex, Osiris, Hyroflow Scarlet, St. Arthur, Shado Yama, Vanfix, and Zach Martin. 